Welcome everyone to my afternoon stream. I'm SheWolf. Alright, so how is the stream going to work? It's going to be of the first half hour to an hour, depending on the game. As I believe in this time, a lot can be determined from a game, whether it's going to pull you in to finish the game or whether you're just playing it for achievements. Alright, the breakdown. The last 10 minutes of this stream, we will go over the parts of the game that I find pull people in the most. 1. The graphics. This is usually the eye candy, and if it's not as you expected, bad textures, poor characters, it's going to determine whether you're going to keep playing or not. 2. The gameplay. Now of course, if the game mechanics are not up to par, you're not going to keep playing. If the game is not running smooth, you're not going to play. So you want to be able to know whether or not the game mechanics and if this game is running smooth for you to actually enjoy it. 3. The story. Now this one can vary as some games don't have stories and they're meant to just be played through just as fun. Others have a great in-depth story that actually pull you in, but does this story actually start off slow? Does it start off fast and pull you in right away? Or is it just a really bad story altogether? And then at the end, I will tell you if I recommend this game or way for sale. I will not be giving a score as there really is no right form of gaming score in my opinion. Just whether or not a gamer to another gamer or a friend to a friend would actually tell you, hey, you need to go check out this game or hey, this game was crap to me. And this is all just my personal opinion. So I hope you guys enjoy and I hope you guys like my form of impressions. Hello guys! So, I hope you guys enjoyed my nice little exploration, well, explanation about how I've decided to start doing my streams and of course I've told you guys this in the past. Sorry, my hair is very fluffy today, but... Oh, that was really loud. Make sure I keep my audio down, of course, of course, for the... So, I hope you guys are ready and I hope you guys are excited to play some Everspace, because hey, I know I am. Hey Mike, thanks for hanging out. I hope uh, you're excited to try this game, like I am. Sorry, just trying to like get my chair figured out here. It's kind of awkward. But, so, alright, uh, let's get into whether or not this game is going to be... First person or third? Ooh, first person or third person? Hmm. I like that. I like the fact that you actually have the option to choose. Now, that is actually pretty neat, but I'm probably going to go inverted or not verted. Not verted, right? I think I'm not verted. Because GKB's inverted, so. Something's not right with me. I'm having memory loops. There was a dispute. I was standing in the way of their plans. I was restrained. Shot with something. Who is this? I managed to escape. That's all I can remember. I must find some answers. My hair is so fluffy. I'm like out of, um, what do you call it? Um, hairspray. Oh, hey, wow. Pilot requires further training. Activating automatic this assistance. actually looks pretty Stand good. By. Uh, assistance? Hey, Magic Mike. Uh, hey, Splashy. Let's see who we got hanging out in YouTube. I also have both going here. So, hey, Frodo. Hey, who's next? Thank you guys for coming and hanging out with me. I'm gonna pop out the chats here, so just give me two seconds, guys, so that I can actually have chats side by side while I'm trying to do this. Thank you for the follow. I really appreciate it. Pop out the chats. All right, so now that I have the chats popped out, I can close the videos down because that 
takes up a lot of stuff. There we go. Okay. Thank you for the follow. Uh, Kush? I guess that would be. Kush? Welcome, Brian. Welcome. Alright, so we have to do the tutorial. Let's do the tutorial. Do you love wolves? Yes, I do love wolves very much. This way. We'll put the mic over here. I do. I love wolves very much. Hello, doggy. Welcome to the stream. Alright, moving forward. Alright, so we're gonna move. I guess I have to get there. Waypoint. Wait, am I going up? Oh, there we go. Ooh, I got it. I got it. I got it. We can drive. Graphics are actually pretty nice in this game. Okay, so... Let's begin by shooting targets. Well, that seems easy enough. See? I can shoot things. Pretty good. At oh, wait. No, they're moving. Wait, do I have to, like, spin around? Oh, I do. Oh my god, I suck at this. Oh wait, I shot one. We gotta shoot another one. Gotta shoot another one, guys. There we go. The These shields. updates are First, great. The I'm going to, to have to play shields. this one later. When the shields are down, use the Gatling gun agree. to inflict greater hull damage. Um, okay, understood. We're not gonna go now. Oh, follow the stars, right? Oh wait, there we go. Wait, what do I have to do? Am I holding up? Oh, okay. Oh, nope, that didn't work. So, I'm officially, like, probably, like, the worst at shooting or, like, playing these kind of things. So, bear with me, guys. We will get this. Oh, crap. I'm like the worst. I'm getting dizzy. Oh, there we go. Oh, where'd he go? Wow. It's very, like, very sensitive. Use missiles on very the next sensitive. Targets. Thank you for the host, Set a target Mike. I really block before shooting it. so the missiles can home in. And if the stream stops by chance, guys, I have, like, a really bad storm going through right now, so... Alright, so... Oh, hey, we can go warp speed. We want to lock on a target. Now, that's putting me into... Wait, that's not working, because I'm pressing the right one? Hold on. Oh, there we go. Okay. Then... Wait, where is he? Oh, there we go. Big kaboom. Do you think they are cute? Yes, I do believe wolves are very cute. Especially cubs. Uh, wait, did I get them? Oh yeah, there we go. That was actually pretty simple. It appears as if you're ready for the next stage. Oh, I have I'm created a jump target. Now. Aim towards it and hold steady to leave the orbit. After each transit, your jump drive requires a cooling, a down, cooling phase. down phase. As soon as it is mm. ready for another jump, I will create one. Interesting. Okay, what is this? Aim, aim at jump target and hold steady until you jump. Like that. I think we got it. We got it. There we go. Okay, so. Um, <laughs> oh, I can pick either one. I guess we'll go here. You'll get the hang of it. Yeah, it's, it's definitely a bit tricky at first, but. Wow, the space is actually As gorgeous. As you can see from your fuel game. gauge, a substantial amount was consumed. Yeah, it during definitely transit. looks better than No Man's Land. Aim to refill the jump drive completely. There is uh, a what are you playing on? I am playing on Xbox Shoot One. It to extract fuel. Or, well, the Xbox One S. If you want to get really technical. What I have to do, shoot... Shoot the asteroid and collect enough fuel. 
Oh, okay. Can I like... Oh, I guess I should have tracked on, right? I guess I should have... Oh, wait. I think I got it. I'll get the hang of this. I will get the hang of this. I got it. We got it. Oh, there's more. That should do it. Remaining well provisioned is key to survival in the cluster. Before leaving the orbit, it is recommended you explore the location for resources. Explore, huh? Let's see. Let's see. What is the waypoint? I have located a container at some distance. Uh, so what's this part? What's this? Ah, resources. I'll just run into it. Weapon. That works, right? But you don't have a free slot. Does to it have it. a story? Decide for yourself whether you want to equip. Right yourself. now, I'm just in the tutorial. Uh, so far, it doesn't really s like. I'm assuming it would. So we go here. Upgrade? Nope. Okay, so open the equip menu. You can drop or salvage equipment there. You can also press A when... Okay. So this is equipment. Build, remove. I don't have anything to build. Am I supposed to drop something? When you floating equipment that you can't pick up to open a compare. I don't get it. I can shoot it. You can press... Okay. So, I'm in... Hmm. Almost at 500. Yes, I am very close to 500. I want to thank everyone who's followed me on Beam. Um, I really appreciate... Uh, I'm just a few off of 500 on Beam, so... If you're in YouTube and haven't checked out my uh, Mixer account, sorry, Mixer guys, it's now Mixer, uh, please go give me a follow on there. I really appreciate it. Make sure you follow the rest of our team. We have GKB, Magic Mike, Foxfire, we have Mooch Crap, we have uh, Noof, uh, so yeah, make sure you go give all of them a follow. I have no idea what I'm doing. Am I supposed to drop something? Build. I don't have anything to build. Does it want me to remove something? Drop? I don't know if I was supposed to do that. I don't get it. I did it. Oh wait, there's another star. Where's the star? Mm, wait, what is this? Um... There is an outlaw ship incoming. I would advise activating your weapon overdrive in order to prepare for the encounter. My weapon overdrive? Okay, so I have to press X. This will enhance your weapon damage considerably. I like the sound of that. Resources are essential for crafting and upgrading oh, there's your equipment. crafting? It appears, however, that we have exhausted our possibilities here. I suggest advancing to the next location. We have the joys. Oh, grab fuel. All right, so then where are we going? 
Turn around. I do like the scenes. The scenes are actually really nice. Hey, Remix. Thank you for joining uh, Shepard404. Thank you. What game is this? We are playing Everspace. Oh, I guess I... I keep forgetting that Beam doesn't... Or Mixer doesn't automatically change that. So I am sorry, guys. I do keep forgetting that. Um... Ever space. There we go. Title is now up top for everybody. Again, I forgot. I really forgot. But that's okay. Alright. So, back to... Back to... We are going... Hmm. Guess we we're driving to the warp thingy or portal thingy. Steady now. Steady. Oh, look. Now I can. We'll go up there. Why not, right? Might as well. Might as well. Hey, Frodo. Thank you for joining. Now on beam. What's my objective? Reaching your destination. And where is that? It's still a long way to go. You will understand more when we get there. I would prefer some more substance oh. to your answer. Emergency boosting for weapons and using device energy. Pay attention to the energy bar below. Okay. Yes. I'm going here. That didn't seem like much. Hey, Jarhead, thank you for joining us. Alright, uh, I guess. So we're doing the tutorial of Everspace right now, guys. Um, doesn't seem to be like a whole lot of craziness. Oh, wait, what's this? You have reached the final location at this sector. Fly through the jump gate in order to reach the next sector. You won't be needed any fuel for the jump. Okay. Jump gates are the primary method of travel between systems. These were built by Grady and Brunt prospects for their mining drones to reach okay. areas more efficiently. Okay, thanks for the introduction. Now you want me to use this? It is the only way to the next sector, so, yes. Low health. That was not good. Where the heck is this thing? I don't have any freaking... What good is that? No, I'm going to die. Where is the stupid thing that I have to go to? I see you are improving. Getting the feel of things. Alright, we're running. We're gonna run for it. Run for it! My key ship component is damaged. It is recommended you fix it before your next encounter. Wow! So. There we go. I got blown up. Oh hey, I got an achievement for getting blown up. Welcome to Everspace. Die. Wow, I got an achievement that just is called die. Well that's kinda cool. You want an achievement? Just die. All right, let's see what happens. What happens now? Perks and upgrades are available. Hmm, perks are always good. That is kind of cool though. Okay, so... Character. Hive. Challenge. Perks. There we go. Okay. We'll upgrade that one. What is this? Damage and repair. Guess can't upgrade that. Uh, 
jump drive. Can I upgrade that? Co oh, cost. Wow. I guess critical hit was like pretty expensive. Can I like get a new ship? Is that a thing? Select. Oh. There's other ships, people. Welcome, Alan. Thank you for the. For joining us. Dirty J, thank you for joining us. We are in the tutorial, guys, of Everspace. So there's three ships, I guess. Okay, so. The way you're meant to die. Normal, the way you're meant to die. Interesting. Why does everything say, like, better off dead, or the way you're supposed to die? Cause hey, everything wants me to fail and die, huh? This time. This time I'll this make time it. This time I'll make it. We'll see about that. Where am I going? Okay, so... Do you reckon there's anything salvageable on this freighter? Probably. But I would not advise it, as it may draw unwanted attention. Okay, so don't do hmm. that. What else do I have to do? Mineral ore. Hmm. Wait, we're not gonna use power. You have extracted raw materials. These are essential for crafting and upgrading. Cool. But you will require much more. Any more, huh? But where, what am I going? So now I'm starting to wonder if there is actually a story because what am I doing? Like they don't want me going near the ship. So I can't go near the ship. Wait, is that something shooting at me? Something shooting at something. It appears we have stumbled upon an outlaw base. Scavengers and raiders of every degree ply the demilitarized zone using these hidden structures to launch operations. I would advise caution on approach. Maybe it's worth the risk. Should I shoot it? That's just what I need. Oh, I went too close. Being shot at now. Oh, I finally see the green thing. Where's the green thing? There we go. I guess that's what I want to do. Guess we will go to this thing. Maybe. Guess we'll go to this one because I went to the other one last time. So we'll do that one. We'll go the opposite ones to what I've already done. And hope and pray. Alright, so where is... There it is. Outlaws, independent operators with varying oh, affiliations, shit. profiting from trafficking, Run! extortion, illegal Run! weapons trading, piracy, clone They're smuggling. Shooting at me. Maybe they They're shooting at me. I have no idea if that's all I'm supposed to do is literally just keep jumping from place to place. I'm really not understanding what exactly I have to do. I'll go this one this time. Guess we'll go this one this time. I didn't see a log. Is there like a log of maybe what I'm supposed to do? Star map. So we got a star map. Stats. Challenges. Okay, so earn 50,000 credits or more in a single run. Destroy 10 outlaw units in a single run. Current run. Swins. Blueprints. Okay, so I guess I'm supposed to 
just get like all right so i think i get the concept we want to achieve these things i guess for money So I guess we'll go shoot some some outlaws. Oh wait, I don't know who that was. Where's the outlaws? Guess we'll come over here because maybe this is the outlaws. Are they like running away? They go. Boom! Blew that up. We blew that up. Wait, I see little blue dots. Fuel! We found fuel. That's what we need, right? Fuel? We need the fuel, people, so we're going to go get the fuel. I'm still not 100% sure exactly what I'm doing, but it looks like I'm just pretty much trying to, like, beat the challenges. So I guess we'll go to the next one. I guess, right? Oh, wait, I didn't go fast enough. Guess we'll go to... The one that I died- okay, so I died at this one last time. Maybe I have to, like, beat this to actually get somewhere? Maybe? They're not really giving me much details. Okay, so there's the jump gate. It's fighters. I guess we'll go on the jump gate. Is that like the main goal in this? I have no idea. Hmm. Enemies in range. Wait, enemies. We got enemies. Guess we'll connect the jump gate. Confirmed. Let's see where we go. I have no idea, so this should be interesting. Strange. Fragments of memories. Oh, maybe we got the story to make now. Sense of them. I had managed to escape. I was weak and ill. My cells were deteriorating. A deadly poison. A cytotoxin. A slow, relentless, eating me away. Okay, so... There was a way to halt its progress, but it would take time. Form of... All I could do was set the wheels in motion. the outcome and stasis. Yeah, I think this would probably be actually a really good like a long, VR game. Uncertain sleep. Sorry. It's like I forgot to turn the AC on before I started this. So my bad. Oh well. Uh but yeah I think it I definitely think it would be a very cool um, I saw myself again. Dying. This must be a memory from the original. Apparently a flaw in the transference protocol. I guess I need a shoot here. The eternal system was meant to filter such personal recollections. Wait, what are you saying? Wait, I'm still being My shot original? here. My original? I'm a... A clone. Where are you? Yes. Usually this is not realized by limited use copies. The function of eternal was to pass on operational skills, such as piloting. But it seems that something has gone wrong here. Stop. This is a lot to take on board all at once. Why is this happening? Hmm. Who am I? 
Who is my original? I have no information on that. Perhaps there is a purpose to this aberration which will become clear upon reaching the coordinates given. I have no answers, unfortunately, but I am as curious as you are. So is that all I do is just keep jumping through wormholes? If that's the case, then yeah, this would definitely be uh, a very interesting game for VR. Or am I supposed to just kind of like last till I die? Cause like that would make a little more sense. Keep going till I die. A jump suppressor is active nearby. That's not good. Well, do something about this? it. Uh, Find when it I played and disable it. The, the higher the signal the preview, strength, the closer no you are. There was going to be a story about it. I don't think there is. Like, is there really a story? Like, it seems very, um... It just seems to, like, kinda... What else can you oh, tell me about this end of the galaxy? Space just took off. New codex, huh? So let's go to the codex. Aw, oh, there's no- I have to- Cluster 34, also known as Final Cluster or simply In this current one- Hmm. Okay. Cluster 34, also well, known like as the Belt of Greens. The a group of systems approximately 1,000 light years from the Sol system. Nothing. Oh, okay. Mapped to precision in the 24th century, but unexplored by colonials until the 30th. Demarcation lines between colonial and native Okar interests are still in dispute. They're like fighting over here, they're fighting outlaws. They are fighting outlaws. stuff here uh you have collected enough resources for crafting go to okay so we can craft something right here build new okay so that's pretty cool so you can build this stuff I want that money 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 yes <laughs> Don't, yeah, I'm crazy. It's okay though. We're gonna go for this stuff, I guess. More credits. More credits. I just said that. Oh, what's that? That thing is blue over there. Before I die, like come on. Too much. Nope, I guess that didn't matter. As you have probably ascertained, hacking comhouse has its benefits. Yeah, until they shoot me. We just keep coming. It breaks the boredom. Breaks the boredom? I guess that's a way to look at it. They came after me. What is that craziness? All right, so Everspace came out. What was it? Um, May twenty six on PlayStation Four, Xbox, and PC. Now, Everspace is described by 
the developers as combined fast-paced combat with roguelike elements, great visuals, and captiv captivating story. It takes you on a challenging journey through an ever-changing, beautiful crafting universe full of surprises. Shoot, craft, loot your way to victory while the odds are stacked against you. Now, okay, so, so far for the story part, um, I guess playing this game for, you know, the short amount of time hasn't completely given me much of a story that I have been able to catch on to. Uh, in full depth to see exactly what I'm supposed to be doing. That's understandable But this game does actually have some ups that I would like to comment on one Right at the beginning you can actually choose whether or not you are first person or third person So they kind of cater to you know both play styles, which I think for game mechanics that is an amazing thing and I also have to say that this being oh i think all my stuff is like damaged for the graphics all right so let's go down the line properly first off graphics the eye candy now i definitely have to say this game is very appealing to the eyes you actually do have the sense of that you're in space and the ships and everything else the rocks the meteors they all actually look really well done this could be a sticky situation here for it being a game preview on the xbox it's also a Steam game and also on PlayStation 4. They actually did a really great job. Like for instance, there's Earth. Yeah, I'm being attacked now. There's Earth and it actually has very nice textures and details to it. I do have to say that for when it comes to the graph- Oh, I died again. Uh, I really died this time. When it comes to the graphics, I have to say that I am really pleased with how they brought the graphics across and how they actually executed the design of this game. Um, I do say that it was actually probably one of the better space games that I have seen when it comes to graphics. So that is a thumbs up for me. Uh, when it comes to the game mechanics now, it was a little bit sensitive to me, but of course I'm sure there's ways to change that in the settings. You were also able to pick right at the beginning whether or not you wanted to be inverted or not inverted. And um, I also find the tutorial was pretty straightforward. It definitely told you how to do things and, you know, everything that you need, like how to move, how to shoot, um, how to target, all that kind of stuff. And that was very simple and very easy to understand. And for most gamers, I'm sure you don't want to go into a game like this where everything seems complex. So the fact that they made it very easy to understand, I think, was actually very great and very, you know, pleasing to me because I was able to understand because uh, space games and shooter games are like well shooters in general are my kind of game but space shooters are not all over like really my style but I was able to play this and you know started getting used to the movements and how it actually goes around uh, Jay hey thank you for joining us uh, yes this is a live video of Everspace uh, I believe this game is actually on PlayStation 4. Uh, hold on, guys. Let me confirm that before I actually... Um, let's see. It's not telling me that it's... I am trying to find... Sorry guys, I'm, I just want to confirm just so that I'm not misleading anybody when it comes to what platforms this game is releasing on. Alright, so it does say that it is available on Xbox One, PlayStation 4, and Windows. So this is for all platforms, so everybody can join and check this game out. Um, also, I would like to add in that, uh, again, with the story... Uh, I'm sure there is one, um, I guess playing just this much of the game, I haven't really been able to get that into the story to see exactly where it's going and how it's leading, but it definitely seems like a type of game that, you know, you drive around and you fight outlaws and as you're going the story will progress and you will learn more of what you're doing really it's like most space games anyone who has ever really well even shows like anyone who has really watched star trek or anything you kind of have your journey go with you as you are going 
uh, for the explorers, you know, they, they learn things as they were going. So I guess in all, this is probably the same style of game where, you know, you're learning things as you go. You definitely earn credits, as you can see on this page, to upgrade your ship and make it better. So you obviously would progress farther and last longer in this game. And I think that makes it really enjoyable as well. So my final verdict on this game, guys, is I would definitely recommend it if you like space shooters. Um, it definitely has the exploring and the beautifulness to this game that would allow you to actually engage in it and probably make it very enjoyable um if you're looking for a story it again they the devs said there is one um but right at the start i guess it's not really uh so well detailed that you know exactly what it is but there apparently is one so make sure you know you go in that with um uh, eyes open and not just expect this glorious story to start off right at the bat and other than that, I just want to say thank you everyone for watching. Um, I hope you guys did enjoy this live stream of Everspace. And I hope you guys tune in later tonight as I uh, will be playing with GKB. We will be streaming Zombie, uh, which is a PlayStation 4 and Xbox game that came from the Wii U. So make sure you guys tune in and check us out tonight as we will be streaming it on Beam, not YouTube. So yeah, make sure you guys check that out. It should be really fun. Uh, yeah, other than that, again... Thank you everyone for uh, who checked it out and watched, and I hope you guys liked my impressions of uh, what I thought about uh, Everspace. So, have a great day guys.